um, hello, this is uh, how to fly a pelican or a um, phantom. Um, first of all, you want to go through all the mission. Um, you can't start from rally point A or B or whatever. Uh, you have to go through the whole mission and uh, you have to get up to the point where you have to return to the HQ. Don't return to the HQ, uh, just go back to the, to the club. Uh, you do need two people for this. Uh, uh, my brother helped me. Um, but you need to go to the club, uh, probably pick up a jetpack from in there when you're fighting the hunters. Uh, fly up to this building and uh, just carry on uh, to this this part of the building. So this is when you want to land your uh, um, falcon or whatever you're flying down here. Um, it depends what you're flying in the first place of what you will end up flying. If you're flying a falcon, you will end up flying a pelican. Uh, yeah, pelican. If you're flying a banshee, or you'll, you'll fly a um, a uh, phantom. But yeah, here's where you need the two-player part. Uh, you need to get the first player. Uh, that's me on top. Uh, on the top of the falcon, um, and it has to be a falcon because uh, you know otherwise you fly off. Um, so I'm just going to speed this up a bit. Um, so yeah, um, there's the button. What you want? That, that's the button you want to press. Um, here is, if you're a good falcon flyer, um, then this is good. Um, so yeah, you want to fly all the way down there. Uh, be careful not to knock your partner off. This is why you need a jetpack, just in case you fall off. Um, it is. I would recommend um, not actually trying to get to the ceiling because you're not squashing your partner on top and killing him. Um, so yeah, you want to fly up. Um, try to get it on your first go. Um, there, and when you hit the button. Then, um, unfortunately, the evac call is uh, no no longer available. It's uh, then dis um, disabled. So if you if you want a falcon, just um, you know, um, kind of get a falcon then. Um, so yeah, now we have two falcons. Uh, you want to kill both or well, all of your gunners. Every, all the gunners have to go, right? Uh, if you, if you want a banshee, otherwise you're gonna the gunners are gonna kill them, uh, which is not good. Um, so, this did take me a bit of time to get a, a falcon. Um, so, yeah, um, I'll cut this part out. Um, so, yeah, you want to stay on top, try to find a, um, a banshee, if you can. Um, if you can't find a banshee, that's good. Uh, don't do what I do and fail and suddenly crash into your floor. <laughs> um, so yeah, you don't want to do that. That's obviously bad. Um, and uh, your partner has to be really steady for this part. So tell, tell your partner, the, the one flying the falcon, tell, tell them to like um, stay calm when they're flying because the banshees will come near you um, and and uh, you, you can't get some close calls like that but see that's that's why you don't want to go too fast otherwise you end up falling off um, so, so yeah, just keep on landing here, respawning him because uh, well, of course, you need to just respawn him all the time um, Uh, when I found this uh, glitch out, I, f I found uh, that uh, that the, the problem about the one of the problems about the glitch is that the uh, phantom uh, it is a bit odd. Um, you can fly through buildings um, and end up killing yourself at the same time, um, which is not good. But the um, the uh, that's one, the pelican. Uh, that that that's good. That's all solid. Um, so yeah, just want to try to get one. Uh, of course, I'm really bad at this. And well, I got one. So.
So yeah, you want to go to that building over there, the one with a tear shop, uh, a teardrop shape in it. Over there, see? Um, that building right there. So yeah, you want to go over there, um, and you just want to fly through the centre. Um, doesn't have to be like dead on or anything. Doesn't have to be at a certain angle. Just, just do this. Just do it. And suddenly, boom! You're suddenly the the you want. The Phantom is incredibly faster than the uh, than the uh, Pelican, um, as you see. Um, this is uh, normal speed. As you can see, um, um, of course, RB is to go up like that and raise altitude. Um, LB is to lower your altitude. Um, the right analog stick, um, that is, um, if if you push up like that, not like down, sorry, um, that's where you, that's where the angle of your ship. Um, uh, that's a bit annoying, um, and of course it's um. It's a lot like the normal player controls and everything, but of course, um, don't don't exit your vehicle. Don't exit your vehicle. Please just don't exit your vehicle. Um, as soon as you exit your vehicle, your vehicle disappears. Um, you can bash into other vehicles with a phantom, um, and you can get inside. Of you can get inside of the vehicle. See, um, a part of the vehicle just disappeared out of, into thin air. Um, just disappeared. Um, uh, but you can get into the side of here and get some guns. Um, yeah. So of course here, here's here's the glitch here. I was telling you about. Look. Um, of course that is obviously bad. Um, so you can get in. You can get in the back of a of a um, of a. Um, Pelican, you can get inside of the Phantom. Um, really good glitch. You can't die. Uh, you go anywhere in the map besides down. Does yeah. You can even fly up to the cruisers. Um, the cruisers up there. You can fly up to those. Uh, there seems to be like a a cube kind of thing in them. It's kind of weird. Um, you probably think, oh cool, we can go up there, check out all the insides. But disappointment. There's you can't, there's no insides. It, yeah, it's just nothing. Uh, so thank you for watching this video, um, uh, rate and subscribe.